Hey guys, I'm back with another video. I know it's been a while, but let's get straight to it. Today I was listening to a <clears throat> Jimmy uh, Hendrix song. It was a blues song. Don't remember what, exactly what it was, but man, there's this cool lick that he just keeps playing that uh, I really am in love with, and I wanted to show you guys uh, this lick. And it's a very common lick he plays. And I'm gonna get go ahead and get straight to it. All right, so it's this lick right here. So, I think that's a relatively uh, easy lick, but it's, for some reason it has so much soul and feel to it, and I love playing it. And ever since, uh, and I've been listening to that, uh, that uh, Jimi Hendrix licks, man, uh, I, uh, <clears throat> I'm i going to just start incorporating it into my playing, man, because it's just so much feel. So basic, but so much feel. So, uh, this lick can be played in any region of the neck. Um, I just happen to... Love the B box, B pentatonic blues box, and that's what we're gonna work out of today. Okay, all right. So here's the lick. I'm gonna go ahead and play it a couple more times so you guys can go ahead and uh, get a good look. We're, we're playing out of the B pentatonic blues scale. <laughs> song that I was actually listening to was uh, Bleeding Heart. I might be wrong about that, but I'll, you guys should go check it out, any uh, <clears throat> hardcore Jimi Hendrix fan. But Alright, so what we're going to do is <clears throat> have the B plant on a blue scale. We're going to go ahead and bend the 10th fret. Alright. 10th fret on the B string. Alright, and then we're going to just, we're going to also bend the uh, <clears throat> ninth fret on the G string as well, but we're, we're going to go ahead and mute that. But then we're going to play it while we're bending up uh, the uh, tenth fret of the B string. All right, just to make things easier. So we're going to go ahead and bend the uh, tenth fret. drag down and we're going to go ahead and play the seventh fret on the G string okay all right so, so let's bend the 10th fret on the B string and let's go ahead and bend <coughs> mute the uh, this the ninth fret of the, on the of the G but we're going to mute it and bend it and then play it while it's up, and then we're gonna drag down and go ahead and play the seventh fret of the the uh, G string. Okay. All right. So here's the first phrase of the lick. All right. So the next phrase we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and bend the tenth fret of the B string again and then now we'll go ahead and slide up to the ninth fret of the G string and bend it and then we're going to go ahead and play the seventh of the B and the seventh of the uh, E and then we're going to go ahead and bend the ninth fret and pull off to the seven. Or you could pick it. I tend to pick it. You could pull off or pick it. 
Alright. Second phrase. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and play the whole lick again. the first phrase. Second phrase. Alright, so that's a cool little Jimmy Andrews look I wanted to show you guys real quick. I thought it was a neat idea and uh uh, maybe that might spice up your blues playing as well. So, if you guys like the video, make sure you leave a like down below. Uh, leave a comment, tell me what you think, um, and see what you might want to see next. And uh, don't forget to subscribe that button to see more videos. Alright, till next time.